Hello and welcome to another unboxing. Today it's the turn of my geek box uh, for March and it's a special one for my geek box because it's their anniversary. So guess what the theme is? Yes, anniversaries. Let's have a look and see what my geek box has inside. This is slightly tough to get into. <laughs> and what do we have first? Now, hmm, this is interesting because everyone's been doing this. So this is a money world. It's a bit like a Funko Pop, but it's plain, so you can actually do things yourself. And this one's kind of a superhero theme type one. It often comes with different bits and pieces to put inside. So it's got two sticker art packs and action accessories, and it's a Wolverine theme. As you can see, and there's different theme ones, so you might get a different one. If you've ordered a my geek box for this month there you go you've got the claws and the stickers inside that's pretty cool and then you can also draw on it as well next up in the anniversary theme is well anniversaries very similar to birthdays so we've actually got a doctor who of the last doctor not the current one um birthday card which has got stickers inside and the comic book as well it's quite a good little thing if you want to uh, give someone a birthday card. Happy birthday. Lots of things inside there. Someone might be getting that if they're a fan of Doctor Who. Now we have Airheads, an orange sweet, which is a US candy sweet, I think. That should be fun. And also uh, a giant Krabby Patty from Spongebob Squarepants which is an interesting one Do -do -do. next out of the box is a Doctor Who The Mind of Evil and the Claws of Axos it's a classic set with the Master based on obviously the episodes from the TV series with the third Doctor, John Pertwee um, I've actually got this one already so this is probably going to go to someone else who's a big fan of Doctor Who. Ooh, sorry about the noise. It sounded like, it like an elephant, but I can assure you there are no elephants inside this box. However, there is Captain America, a collectible figure. And it doesn't look too bad, actually. Looks pretty good. Will probably go up on my shelf with my other figures, which I haven't got hardly any space for anything left anymore. And finally, we have a t shirt with a kind of retro Ghostbusters almost. So this looks like a bit like either the Ghost from Pac Man or, um, but with a kind of Ghostbusters setup with a um, backpacks and everything which is pretty cool so that's something a bit different and of course it's a Ghostbusters anniversary yeah so there we go that is the my geek box for this month for March pretty good thanks guys and here's to another good year bye and thanks for, for watching